Aspirants, fellow free melons, welcome back to the society. I'm Eli, and in keeping with my world heavyweight title in simplicity in diet, I am going to give you a recipe today that is so simple, it's going to blow your mind, so easy to prepare, uh, very few ingredients, and is super, super healthy for you. A wonderful meal on its own, or an addition to other combinations that you can make on your own. I'm going to teach you today how to make TPT. And what does TPT stand for? It stands for tomato, pepper, and tomato sauce. <laughs> Two ingredients. Sorry, I lied. There's one extra ingredient. You add garlic. Okay, so let me show you what this looks like. So in order to make TPT, you need, like I said, tomatoes, garlic, and peppers. That's about it. All you're gonna do is you're going to throw some tomatoes into a blender. You need a blender for this, unfortunately, or a Vitamix or whatever. So you're gonna add some tomatoes into the blender. Two to three should be enough. And you're also going to add one to two cloves of garlic, probably not more than that because you don't want the sauce to be too stingy. The garlic is very, very healthy. You definitely want it to add a little bit of seasoning or flavor but no more than two, depending on how many tomatoes. I, I would recommend just going with one clove for, for now if you're doing this for the first time. So you're gonna blend up those contents until you have a sauce. Then with the rest of your tomatoes, you're just simply gonna slice them up into whatever sizes you like and put them into a bowl. Then you're gonna grab raw peppers. Don't cook them, you don't need to cook them. Although, it's up to you, you can cook your peppers if you like but it's not necessary with this recipe and you'll you'll see when you actually taste it so you chop up your peppers into equally sized pieces as your tomatoes are throw them all in the bowl now you're almost ready all you got to do is add your sauce into the mix and voila you have a brutally simple very hearty meal now the wonderful thing about tpt is that you can add TPT as a base to something else. So if you have a vegetable meal, for example, let's say you've got a salad, you can add a little bit of TPT to your salad and you'll have a, a fantastic meal or a fantastic salad. You can eat TPT totally on its own and it's a great meal. You can omit the peppers and just have the tomatoes and garlic and that can be a morning smoothie. The raw garlic on its own it is very, very potent. Lots of health benefits to eating garlic raw. The, the problem is overcoming the bite and the sting of garlic. So by blending it up with some tomato, then you uh, you can get the benefits without having to go through the... Uh. There's so many uses for this simple recipe. Uh, it, it's a great one if you are looking to clean up your diet and you don't know where to start, then I, I highly recommend this as, uh, as a dinner or as an addition or a base to uh, a vegetable uh, a vegetable meal. Anyway, that that's it. Brutally simple recipes, but you know what? Again, as I always say, the beauty lies in the simplicity. Uh, I really hope you try out TPT. If you're an aspiring clean eater, then I encourage you to try this because this is a wonderfully easy meal to prepare. And it takes no time at all, and it's very, very healthy. And, and of course, having only a couple of ingredients, very easy to digest. Your, your, your body will just take this in and be like, oh, thanks, not, not much to deal with today. And, you know, you'll have good absorption and uh, you'll, you'll be on your way. So anyway, yeah, give TPT a shot. Let me know what you guys think of it. Let me know what combinations you use TPT for because I'd love to know myself. I'm sure there are ways of applying this simple base that I, that I haven't thought of. So, um, you know, give me your thoughts in the comments and and yeah, that's it for now, guys. Thank you so much for coming back to the Society. I'll see you next time on the next video.